Three months ago, I made this 1950s scooter electric. But unfortunately, after using it for a bit, I sort of broke it. Now, I threw that away and decided to make a new one. So stay tuned to that anyway. Here's the story of exactly what happened. So we're starting this video out in a bad note. Fortunately, I was riding the scooter for a couple months. I broke it. And um, I took out the batteries in the seat. And we're building a new scooter today. Still a scooter, but it's not gonna be vintage like this. So let's get straight to cutting this off because we're gonna need this rear end and putting it on the new platform. So here we have the two rear ends all together. I'm gonna to try to put these two together, these on, and I won't be needing these because they already are this. So let's get straight into installing these two pieces together. Okay, right. Alright, so off camera I hooked up with the wire and let's see if it turns on. It's on. Okay, it moves. I hooked up the charger. Now we're gonna see if the charger works. If I hooked everything up right, let's see. Ah. Let's see. It's working. So unfortunately yet again I got broken and I got a flat tire this time and it was not good. It was literally out of nowhere. So I bought a tube out of from Amazon and installed it, put some air, let it air up. The tire is supposed to be holding like 40 psi. I put it on and after that I mounted the tire. Here you can see the tube where it broke. I mounted the tire on, tightened it all up, installed the chain all that and it should be ready to go again next video of this thing hopefully 
it would be completely done. It's going to be completely different. Planning on doing a lot of custom work to this little scooter, so stay to the end. Gotta catch you next time. Peace and God bless.